Hello and welcome back to Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. And we are tabbing our way through the lair at the moment. Um, okay. Fairly scary. I need to run away. Uh, the entrance to the swamp here. <clears throat> Twisted ring mail. <clears throat> so, what's this gonna be? Hmm. Well, it lowers my AC a whole lot, but regeneration and intelligence. But twelve points of AC. Don't think that's worth it, Oka. So this until they are level 15 and a little bit of invocations. Berserk. Uh, <clears throat> oh, ghost kin. 
powerful ogre berserker with a weapon of protection. That sounds very dangerous. So. Nope. Oh, shit. I'm trapped between a bunch of elephants and that ghost. I'm gonna read the teleport scroll right away. And there we go. <laughs> Seems like teleports have changed in this version. I always teleport very short distances, it seems. Not sure what's up with that. See anything in the change log about teleports? So I don't know. Well, most of this level is done, so I guess we can move down to layer eight. Oops, Deathy Axe. Ice cave here as well. It's cool. I don't have any cold resistance though. Stasis. Wow. This unknown scroll is brand weapon. I don't really want a brand. Can I? Yeah, I'll waste the scroll. <clears throat> mm. Well, we might go into the ice cave. If I find it. I'm not too worried or stressed. Oh, it's nearby. Uh huh, here. Ice Dragon. <clears throat> well, our flaming weapon is going to be very good against these ice monsters, so. I'm gonna try the puce potions. Curing. Oh, I, I haven't found. I haven't identified curing. Oops. Something okay. Mm -hmm. 
some more invocations. Ice crusted shallow water. Got a gift. Ooh, we're in the cloak. Put it on, it's hopefully better than a plain cloak. It is. Um, but... Yeah, it doesn't let me actually go invisible. <clears throat> this might... Oh, it does, yeah. some changes so that the cloak would just increase your hunger and make you more stealthy. I think I read something about that, but it probably was a different item. Okay, I can deal with you, Frost Giant. It can be dangerous works on curses. Uh, the cloak. Just 
ring of stealth is quite useless. Um, darts, one disintegration. Should be good for now. some shield skill would be good as well at least for a while I might switch to two-handed weapons at some point but um, I want to know what all the potions are and I want to know how many charges this one has That's, oh zero let's recharge it of magic okay what's this scroll oh thank you torment I was hoping for acquirement but <laughs> I got pretty much the opposite so to speak I usually seem to find the first scroll of acquirement in the lair. So I like to kind of finish as much of it as possible. goes terribly wrong. Uh, oh, it's working. Maybe. Come on. Yes. Whew. Okay. Okay. 
Uh, well, javelins. We could. Oh, yeah, we ran away from something here. <clears throat> Let's quickly get through this level. guy we ran away from. <laughs> so, yes. Another gift, and it's a ruined hat. Hey, good. It's a good hat. This is the actual guy we ran away from, it seems. Well, I don't know, maybe we'll use a deck of cards. So it's kind of cool to get or to use some evocable items, evocations with a character like this as a, like an alternative to to magic. blue potion <gasps> experience nice I'll drink that makes me to level 15 and to level five. X whoops access to nineteen. Hmm. I think I actually want evocations. <coughs> yes. 
And I want some dexterity. This time. All right. Dare to quaff ID some more. Well, let's um, let's continue down here. Oh, Sonia. is going to work fine here. summons all these spectral orcs and then she uses death's door to do not die so to speak but let's see if we can't kill her quickly and we can <laughs> okay my plate armor oh well anyway I'm <clears throat> not gonna need this um, probably not these Heal wounds. That's beautiful. Okay.
fragility. Level 16, haven't even done the Orcish Mines yet. <laughs> so identify the heal wounds, one, five charges. found the entrance to the Orcish Mines. Yep. So I think I'll just dive in. I want to know what my potions are. <clears throat> Once again, what's the worst that could happen if we drink? We could waste a cure mutation, we could get decay or Degeneration. Both of those are temporary, I think. Let's see the smoky emerald potion. Oh, that was <coughs> indeed degeneration. Okay, that's fine. Um, lumpy sapphire potions, brilliance. It's not something we are gonna need. And the murky white is restore abilities. Okay, great. there stage and we Ooh. I'm curious about this ruined plate armor let's just try it no it's ah. Fire resistance. Well, I guess that's better than the chain mail, so. And we might never use it, but. Hmm. 
take the scroll of teleportation for now, the rest can wait. Huh. That's an interesting plate armor with dexterity plus six. That it won't let me cast spells is. Well, that has <laughs> no <clears throat> effect really. So let's. Uh, I want to check out all the shops before I buy it, but. Seems to be it for <clears throat> level two. Let's have a look here as well. Okay, more money. stuff but I don't think I want to spend any money on that right now holy cow a crystal plate armor oh that one is awesome Strength high enough. Yeah, that should be better than the normal plate. If my strength and armor skill is good enough. Okay, shields is enough. Let's train armor then. Uh, <laughs> Out of place. Okay, we have a sorcerer, and the crystal plate is a bit to get at least one of these messages, but it's not too bad, so. Glowing 
loves. magic points. Well, maybe, yeah, we do need them for Okavaru's abilities, so... Warlord. Yeah, we can deal with this. Decision. Sustainability is magic resistance and strength plus six. Yes, I want that. I'll put it on <coughs> instead of the ring of wizardry. Now I think I'll just enchant this one. <clears throat> General store. Heal wounds. Pizza. <laughs> this one looks a bit cool, but I guess it's not for me. Weapon Boutique. Eh. Uh, ruined Battle Axe, well, no. If I find a good Executioner's Axe, I'll switch to... to two-handed axes, but... <clears throat> if not, I'll... Stick with the broad axe for quite a while. Go back to the dungeon. I forget all about stuff I was gonna buy. 
Um, I guess the plate armor is out of the question. Yeah. But... <clears throat> I am too curious about these artifacts. So let's... Um, Buy it all, yes. The gloves are just plus one. <coughs> that was a waste. The distressingly furry scale mail. Minus four. Slay minus four. Strength plus. Uh, no. <laughs> it's interesting, but susceptibility to fire. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, I was a bit optimistic, but. Further down the dungeon, I guess we do. Yeah, we should be able to take some. Well, we haven't finished this level, so I'll do that and then I'll end the episode. So we're past 50 minutes now, so oh god. Almost past 50, 50 minutes, so. <laughs> Ooh. Rod of ignition can explosive bolt. This is new phantom mirrors. A hand mirror which can create a reflection of a nearby creature, shattering in the process. The reflection's duration increases with evocation skill and decreases with the magic resistance of the target. It is invariably slightly weaker than the creature it mirrors. I wonder if it's if the, the reflection is friendly or how that works. Hopefully we will find out. Okay. Dungeon level twelve.
requirement. Well, armor. <gasps> wow. Plus three gauntlets of war with slaying plus five. That's so perfect gauntlets for me. Or this character. Nice. And I said I was going to end this video, so why not end it here? <laughs> yep. Um, okay, so good progress has been made, and and uh, this is looking good. So thank you for watching, and goodbye for now.